Assalamu alaikum brothers, sisters and friends. Today I'm going to be discussing a topic that affects all of us. It's titled, Why Can't I Stop Sinning? As we know, man was made weak, limited and dependent. In fact, all of us are prone to error, every single one of us. Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam said, the best of those who repetitively make mistakes are those who repent. So all of us are sinners and the best of us from mankind are those who turn to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and this is beautiful because we acknowledge his existence and his attributes of rahmah. Also, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says that if we as a nation did not sin, he would replace us with a nation who did, purely so that they would seek forgiveness and Allah would surely forgive all their sins. Also, the Sahaba who were most beloved to Allah and Rasulullah وسلم, and the best of companions that were granted paradise, they sinned as well. So there's no doubt that Allah would forgive us also. In fact, in Surah 39, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says, Do not despair in my mercy and I will surely forgive all your sins. Also, he says, O son of Adam, if you come to me with sins as great as the earth and you turn to me, so if you turn to Allah and you ascribe no partners in your ibadah, so you do not commit shirk, he would forgive you nearly as the same as it. So no matter how big your sins are, he will nullify it and grant you good deeds. I hope and pray that this reminder is beneficial to all of us. And no matter how distant you are from Allah, even if you abandoned your salah and your dua and you feel worthy and you don't feel worthy, remember that this is shaitan's trick so you don't turn to your creator. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.